Hi, so I'm Peter Myers. I've come from Australia, Melbourne, Australia, and I'm here in Zagreb as a Microsoft event, and we're sharing information and uh, passion, my passion, around the new generation of offerings for data with Microsoft. Uh, the majority of the day we're talking about Power BI, so how we can enable self-service analysts to go ahead and enable and produce solutions using a familiar tool of Excel. So in Excel, we're teaching them how they can use Power Query to access data sources, familiar and even um, uncommon sources like Facebook, Exchange, Active Directory, and how with ease they can filter, shape, and load this data into the workbook to prepare data for analysis. One of the major topics has been Power Pivot and the ability to bring together data with relationships, uh, calculations, and uh, express this data uh, in a way that's easy to understand and with high performance. Uh, we're just about to talk about the data visualizations with another power uh, add-ins of Power View, uh, Power Map, and both of these provide very um, interactive, feature-rich, presentation-ready visualization of data. Uh, power Map especially looks great on top of uh, maps in three dimensions and animated across time. We also talk about how we can effectively share these workbooks in a secure way that manages automatic data refresh and cool features like using natural language querying to pose questions in English at this stage against the data model. We're also here to talk about the big data story and that increasingly we find that companies have larger volumes of data, perhaps structured or unstructured data, and that the technology has arrived at the point of allowing us to store reliably large volumes of data in any file format and to query this by using Hadoop. And Hadoop essentially uses a uh, map reduce paradigm, very, very different to the way we conventionally store and query data in relational systems. So we're here to talk about why we have big data, the uh, problems that can be solved, and how this enables new scenarios like social analytics and predictive capabilities. Microsoft have a role to play with this with Windows Azure HD Insight, the ability for us to store data and to process big data loads within the cloud. So I'm here to encourage people to be aware and to try this out for themselves. The features available with Power BI are available with Office 2013 and Office 365. Uh, these editions and versions of Excel support the Power BI capabilities. Uh, if you're not using these versions today, we very much encourage that you download an evaluation copy today and the Power BI site in the cloud. There's a 30-day free trial and we very much encourage that you register and try this out for yourself to discover what you can achieve with your data.